The Hanjin Subic Shipyard is a renowned shipbuilding facility in the nation of the Philippines. It has been consistently ranked as amongst the best foreign investments within the national borders. With consistent hiring of thousands of workers and pouring out billions of dollars in sales, this 300 hectare development, which has a 600,000 deadweight tonnage of annual shipbuilding capacity, is located within the Subic Freeport Zone, a special economic zone that is mainly destined for foreign investments. But the life of the Hanjin shipyard is numbered, and the future is going to change. The shipyard emerged in the year 2006 when the South Korean contractors had laid out a billion dollars worth of investments to open up this shipyard repair facility in Subic Zambeles area. At the year of its construction, it had already employed well over 6,500 people, a dramatic feat as the economy of the Philippines was not as strong as it is today, yet international investments were keen on this specific seaside destination. With consistent efforts from the Hanjin Heavy Industries to push this Subic Big shipyard into a profitable scheme after its tremendous investments, they were able to produce over $5 billion in sales from the year 2009 to 2014. They had gone from producing, fixing, and rehabilitating containers and ships to becoming one of the greatest foreign investments in the entire nation. They were at one point in 2015 named as the top 10 shipbuilders in the entire world in terms of order book, and this helped the Philippines position itself among the largest shipbuilders around. Unfortunately, however, disaster struck, and all the grand scheme of investments had come to an end. By 2019, the company had filed for voluntary rehabilitation under the Republic Act 10142, which is used by financially distressed enterprises or individuals. With the tremendous economic activity and opportunity it has brought over its lifetime, however, after it had gone out of business, several international players have emerged to see the importance and strategic advantage to have this shipyard. US-based Cerberus Capital Management and Australia-based Austal had launched plans on purchasing and taking over the former Hanjin Subic Bay shipyard, hence launching a new world of opportunities in the coming future.